Hey folks, in this video we're going to be talking about Morella cervifera. This is our bayberry, our wax myrtle shrub. It's most commonly referred to as wax myrtle. Um, you can see in overall form, it is a shrub. Um, it can get much taller than this, but this is um, what it looks like in the understory here at Lake Johnson. Um, you can see up close, it's got these leaves that are alternately arranged along the, the stem. And they are sort of tapered towards the end of the um, leaf and then towards the tips you can sometimes get this toothing um, towards the tip of that leaf. Um, the most important part about identifying this leaf though is you actually might want to pluck one off. You can see um, overall shape you kind of got that lanceolate um, or odd lanceolate leaf. Um, let me see if I can get it to focus. You get those toothing towards the edge and then the entire margin towards the tapered base of that leaf. But if you get really close and look at the surface of that leaf, you can actually see these little yellow glands on there. You see those little yellow glands? Um, and those actually have a really nice smell to them. So if you were to crush this and then smell this leaf, it has a really nice aromatic scent to it. You can actually see them super well in the bottom of that leaf. Um, a lot of people will use a hand lens to look at these. Um, you can see up close, they're actually kind of orange glands, um, but on the surface of the leaf at our eye level, you can see they look kind of like little yellow dots. And that's going to help you distinguish this leaf from almost everything else that looks like it. Um, the actual shrub itself, if you look, you can see um, its um, bark is kind of this light gray color down here. It's got this light gray bark um, that can be kind of tannish. It's relatively smooth even as the um, tree matures. It can get some cracking near the base as it gets older. Um, but yeah, this is a small, to, um, or this is a medium-sized shrub typically. It can be a little bit larger. Um, if you often see it planted in landscaping around um, Raleigh in North Carolina. Um, I think it's more common um, natively to the coast. Um, but yeah, this is wax myrtle, Morella cerifera.